The last few months have been incredibly difficult. For the members of NYSCOBA, as well as our brothers and sisters in healthcare, police professional firefighters, and all other essential union personnel who don't have the luxury of staying home during this crisis, we remain as committed as ever to being a strong voice for all those on the front lines of this pandemic. As you have continued to go to work each and every day in DOCS, OMH, OPWDD, SUNY and other essential state facilities, you recognize the inherent risks already present in your jobs and the added dangers to your own safety due to the health crisis. I'd like to thank you all for your professionalism throughout this pandemic as a vital frontline worker. We have continued to fight for greater workplace protections for members in all our facilities and have been successful in providing more PPE to our members in reducing transmission rates. We remain staunchly against the practice of double bunking and we hope to eliminate this dangerous policy to ensure greater safety for both correction officers as well as inmates. We are also committed to fighting against any additional prison closures and pushing for the implementation of the Secure Vendor Program. This pandemic is far from over and there's still much work to be done. As we continue to navigate these uncertain times and new norms, NYSCOBA will continue to support its members and their families. I know that by working together to solve common goals, we will all be able to get through these trying times and emerge stronger as a result. We wish everyone a safe and happy summer, and God bless you all.